Have you ever wondered if PETA could find a way to be more annoying than throwing blood at you? <laughs> Surprise, they have a Twitter account. <laughs> Yesterday, PETA announced they hope to replace anti-animal language with alternative phrases. Instead of saying, kill two birds with one stone, they want you to say, feed two birds with one scone. <laughs> Instead of saying, take the bull by the horns, they want you to say, take the flower by the thorns. <laughs> of course, what all of these new phrases actually translate to is, you're going to want to find someone else at the party to talk to. <laughs> and PETA claims that anti-animal phrases are just as bad as prejudicial language used against humans, tweeting, just as it became unacceptable to use racist, homophobic, or ableist language Phrases that trivialize cruelty to animals will vanish. Unacceptable to use racist and homophobic language. PETA, have you read Twitter? We've got bigger fish to fry. Oh, I'm sorry. We've got a bigger wish to fly. But hey, maybe... Maybe I'm behind the times, and there are a lot of other common phrases that are unfair to animals, things that I've never even thought but we, we, that we all say to each other all the time. Yeah. For example, instead of saying, you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make him drink, you should say, your horse has a drinking problem and needs counseling. <laughs> and instead of saying, there's more than one way to skin a cat, it's much more sensitive to say, there are three ways to skin a cat, but that's not really what I call first date conversation. <laughs> And don't say, let's eliminate all the gorillas with extreme prejudice. Woke people say, let's circle back on this tomorrow. <laughs> and I think we've all said, let's lock this giraffe in an abandoned laundromat and emotionally abuse it until it doesn't... <laughs> this is the price of not rehearsing. <laughs> I think we've all said, let's lock this giraffe in an abandoned laundromat and emotionally abuse it until it doesn't know who to trust anymore. <laughs> but next time, try Thursday works for me. <laughs> You're welcome, PETA. We'll be right back with Jeff. <laughs>